Hello everyone, I'm Manfred, I'm your chocolate doctor and today we will make a chocolate brownie with hazelnuts and a 64% village chocolate. Now it's quite easy and easy to bake at home as well there. So all what we need to do is we will take a bowl and melt the chocolate with the butter together. So the butter we put in a bowl, we add the chocolate and we put it over a water bath memory. Our eggs, sugar, custard sugar, and brown sugar. This one we will try to whip as foamy, creamy as possible. As you see, this one is nice and creamy. Okay. Now, next is we add the flour and the hazelnut. We add all the chocolate. Sure, all the chocolate is well mixed together. Then we add the dry ingredients. So, if this one is, you see, nicely mixed together, and pour it into the tray. Okay, we have it now on a, on a baking tray, which is lined out with greaseproof paper, and we will bake it at 180 degrees Celsius for about 18 minutes. So now we're preparing for a chocolate sauce because we want a nice rich brownie with chocolate sauce. What we do is first is we have here some sugar, some water and milk. This one we bring to boil. So then this one start boiling. We add the cream. We add a fresh cream. And we add the butter. The next is we have cocoa powder, relish cocoa powder. Make sure the cocoa powder is seed. We switch off and add our chocolate. We add again the 64% relish chocolate. Wow, very nice. We'll put another board on top so we can turn it around. So we can make it two different ways. We can put the chocolate sauce at the bottom. and put our brownie on top. We put a couple of nuts, ice cream, make it really fudgy. Again, we have our nuts. Then, Put here some, some fruits, you can use mango, strawberry, raspberry, or what kind of fruit you like to use. Put a little bit some mint for decoration and give a little bit color as well. Get a bit of smet chocolate on decoration. All right, so that's for today. We made a hazelnut chocolate brownie on a rich chocolate sauce with some fruits. Banana chocolate goes always well together. Also, you can use strawberries. 
I use here some ice cream, a fruit ice cream as well, mango, but you can use vanilla ice cream as well. Now let's try. How do we want to eat it together? Mm. It's fantastic. Very soft, still have the nuts taste, the crunchy stuff inside there, the chocolate, and then the ice cream, the cold ice cream. Very good dessert for the summertime. Thank you very much for listening or watching the video. Should you have any problems, any questions, please contact your chocolate doctor. I'm happy to help you out. Happy cooking.